So I've always just really been interested in storytelling and I've been fortunate that that's what I get to do for a living. Hi, I'm Britt Bennett and I'm an author. Claudia is somebody who is very curious about other people. She's always kind of asking questions about other people, wants to know where they came from. I think my first introduction into American Girl was my older sister who had an Addie doll. We shared her. <laughs> and I just remember thinking the doll was really beautiful. I loved the books. I thought the story was so compelling. I had tweeted at American Girl begging to write a book. I suggested 1920s Harlem uh, as a setting for the story because I've always just really loved the Harlem Renaissance. As a black writer, I've always been really interested in that time period and setting as this outpouring of black creativity and black beauty. I think one of the most fun parts of planning the book was thinking about the different people that Claudia would meet. And I loved the idea of her being kind of like a little sister to these other adults who are in this house with her, who are all sharing about their art to her and also about their life. My favorite thing about the Claudia doll, I love her hair. I think her ringlets are really cute. I think the moment where the book felt really real for me was when I saw the illustrations visualized in this really vibrant and beautiful way. I think it's important for American Girl to create characters like Claudia. She's alive in well, such an interesting time period. It's exciting to see more black characters just in general. It's exciting to be part of that as well. To think about that kind of next generation reading something that you wrote, carrying that story with them is something that I just think is really important for anybody who's a writer to kind of think about what you're passing off to that next generation. That's something that will always be very special to me.